Is the internet instigating that issue between you and L here that that's just for play or is that real? I never met that man a day before in my life. Mm -hmm. So the only reason why my response, the only reason why I responded is because I let motherfucker play with my name too much. I've been humble for too long. And then I had to learn, like when you humble, motherfucker run over you. Cause you've been putting pressure on him, bad man. I've been trying to take pressure the pressure off him though, but when when the niggas trying to promote off me, but don't want no no street conflict, that shit kind of rubbed me the wrong way. Cause I don't know how to play it now. Like you want to be on some entertaining shit, but you you want to disrespect me, and I don't let nobody disrespect me. So if I let you get that way with disrespect me, niggas in the streets that really doing that gonna act, feel like they can disrespect me. So like little bitch ass niggas can't be disrespecting me like for real so i ain't really been putting no pressure on them but you can't be dropping songs and tell me out we just gonna be entertaining like when you see me don't do nothing to me bro let's just right. i feel like if, if we in santa lenny records he sang with him not even though but like bro this chicago this ain't fucking worldwide music this chicago like these spots motherfucker get caught caught there so shit. You can't be like, yeah, bro, I know I want to go outside this summer. I don't want to see you downtown and y'all fuck me up. But I want to get my little cloud up off you. You can't do that because I'm going to see you downtown fuck you up. And I, <laughs> I can't control that. You can control that. What about Fendi Boy? Is that real? Hell yeah, yeah, that's real. I can hear you lying in like one of Fendi Boy's songs that was kind of like... He said something about my mama. He probably yeah, still yeah, got yeah, knocks yeah. on his fucking head. You keep, you keep saying you my name yourself. like I want to pop up like Candyman on your you ass. you goofy, folks. You goofy, you dirty. Why you keep saying my name, bro? Why you not in your hood? Why and you I keep wrote, saying my name? And when and I'm not in my hood. hood. Merch, I you ain't even got no hood, hood, man. Merch, I wrote it through your hood in the morning time. Merch. I got straight stumped out like seven different times. And that's real, because that was the next thing I was going to ask you. Yeah, you kind of yeah. alluded to something happening to him. I put a lot of people on his ass, and they was really fucking him up. And they was really fucking him up. And when they get out, shit, they going to be in the videos and shit. Gang them. Shit, cause th that's what I owe them. Cause Shorty said some crazy shit about my mama. He hope she died from cancer or something, nigga. You don't even know. Me. And that put a lot of pressure on him too, though. Cause now I'm a likable motherfucker, and I got a lot of street credibility. You dissing a lot of motherfucking people love. And then on top of that, you come at me for the clout, but you over, over, over. Your friend died off that shit. Like, dog, he just I woke up, he was dead. You getting people killed? You fucking trolling motherfuckers. Now you in the county in this fucked up situation. And niggas like me can control that because they got tablets and shit and they listen to music. They see the same shit you doing, the goofy shit and how we handling it. So they fucking you up off that shit. A motherfucker looking at it like, damn, even on some funny shit, damn, he said he got a hundred noodles, we, we fuck shorty up. Everybody gonna fuck him up. What if you gotta go die with a hundred noodles? They gonna fuck him up just to say they fucked him up and they feel good about fucking him up. And I feel good that he get fucked up because he shouldn't have been trolling. This shit is should be to pay your bills, not to be on no street credit. If you want street credibility, don't do no rap shit. Do the street shit, then do the rap shit. The rap shit, you gotta get your money. Mm. You wanna try and get no money off that shit. You wanna beef people see in the streets. Did she ever meet him like in real life? Hell no, nah, right. right. But that internet, that shows you like that internet, the power of the internet. Mm. I met him on the internet, got him fucked up through the internet. Mm. I didn't have to meet him. Mm. He beat himself. Mm. Internet shit dangerous like that though. So, yeah, yeah. Right. You can tell. You be on live, man. All my fans, you catch shorty. Beat his motherfucking ass downtown. What the big mama? Then you gonna see a video going viral. Motherfucker downtown get beat up with their big mama. Damn. That's how powerful the internet is. So they need to be glad the niggas that's really got real, real power ain't doing any type of shit. Cause these niggas got coke fan bases and shit. Motherfuckers be stomping you out while you with your people and them all type of shit. You know, this is probably the most asked question you'd have been asked. I told